Oh uh, yeah, rank 7. It's all gonna pay off in the end, I guarantee you, but keep working at it. It's good. Anyways, I should probably talk about Cochase, because we're Cochase and he's awesome. He's my other favorite warrior, aside from Ajax, but I know what you want. You want stats, so let's get into it. Coaches got heavy skill when it comes to mugging. He's solid at resisting arrest, lockpicking, uncuffing, and stealing. But he's real lame with tagging. And as you can see, his strength, stamina, and health are kind of average, but his rage is very good. Now, that's actually going to make up a lot. You see, while his rage is really good, his strength is kind of eh, it's kind of average, but he makes up for that. Because you see, Cochase is fast. The only thing that he's really going to fail in comparison is his health, because he can't really take a couple blows. But as I said, Cochase is fast. I mean, he is just a really quick attacker. And in fact, let's get this out of the way. We got a turf invasion. It's a good example of how fast Cochase is. And we got the hurricanes. You ever try to grab a hurricane, man? It's like grabbing air! Oh God, Sanchez, you will never leave my head now, will ya? Anyways, so let's get it started. You see that? You see that? That's how fast Coaches is. He is quick, man. He is quick. The only downside is, uh, yeah, the Hurricanes have a tendency to throw you off if you grab them. So not really a good chance to try to show off some combos, but I'm gonna try to do whatever I can because you know what? Oh, it's so freaking sweet. I love Cochase's combos. Ajax has some brutal ones. Cochase has some pretty crazy, insane ones. But they're also pretty brutal, I'm not gonna lie. Especially the ones in which he's enraged. He's just... Oh, God. Hopefully I can show him off. Because if I can show off everything that I can with Cochase now, I don't really have to worry about it later. And that would be good for me. Anyways... So, uh, we gotta kinda hunt out some of the hurricanes because, you see, as these turf invasions expand, you get more guys that you have to go after, and, well, the hurricanes are clearly one of that, but we got so many of them that they actually kinda branch out into different areas. So you're gonna have to hunt them down. It's just what you're gonna have to do. Oh man, what did he do? Did he just like slash his face with a bottle? That was awesome! Love you, coaches! I love you! Oh man, we're in rage! We're in rage! Oh yeah, bring it, man! Bring it! God! He just like twisted his head and then punched him in the head. That was brutal! Alright, can I do it? God! He just twisted his arm and then punched him in the face! See how sadistic Coaches is? I love it! Also, as I should mention, when you're Coaches and you go into exploring Coney, you have Vermin escorting you. Now, I admit, Vermin isn't as good as Ajax. In fact, if Ajax was ex no, excuse me. If Ajax was escorting you around Coney, this would be the greatest team ever, honest to god. The only warriors I need, Cochase and Ajax. That is the greatest team. That's why I liked Mission 7. Because, uh... That was pretty sweet, not gonna lie. Although, I won't lie. I mean, Vermin did gain a little bit of respect in the last part. Because he did get a clean shot on Virgil with the bottle. And that was pretty sweet. He still fails in comparison to the most of the other warriors, though, in my opinion. My opinion. And, um... You're not a hurricane, are you? I just assaulted some random pedestrian. I'm sorry, guy. I'm sorry. This is the guy I was really after. And we completed the bonus objective. Yes. And we get nothing for it. I'm sorry. But, uh, you know, in the next part, tomorrow, we will totally go on with the mission in which we actually get to use Cochase. And it will be awesome. And, uh, yeah, that's about it. Later, guys.